Sat down with us yesterday and said, hey, listen, you're going to see some of that offense, but it's more for the blocking schemes. Watch us in the first couple series. We're going to throw a lot of window dressing. Almost every play has been a different formation. They're trying to see what Washington will do to the different formations and then make adjustments. After a loss of two, third and 12, first down awaits for Frederick. At the 41, five out there to catch it for him. In the seat of the zone, Marjorie Hooks across midfield and to the Washington 41-yard line. They picked up 29 on third and 12. Okay, what Federick did this time was the key to strong safety or free safety. As he come back, he watched as the receiver went down the field and watch him. Watch his eyes right here. He'll see him right there wide open. Number 14 was a beautiful pass. The play was good and well designed because Hooks with this team. And the longtime BYU assistants. You can say that about almost all of their staff. Margin Hooks breaks into the secondary. Margin Hooks to the 33-yard line. Curtis Williams pulled him down from behind after 38 yards and exactly what Kirk was talking about before. Goes back to Lee's original point in the first quarter about how it can be tough sometimes on a quarterback when you get back in shotgun. Look at that. Look how he gets rid of the ball. That's tough on a quarterback to get the grip on the ball and get rid of it. There's a soft coverage by Bontor. Now Margin Hooks is going to do the rest. He makes the first guy miss. He's going to use some speed to pick up some big yards. They got that kind of play. Pickens on the bottom of the screen now in motion. Frederick looking back to the right. Like touchdown! Lenny Haynes, 22 on Washington cover. Hunt's been on to make it 14-7. Blocked. Could be returned for two points, remember. Lester Towns lost it, picked it up. And is brought down by Jesse Sowers. Special teams in the first game. Kevin Federick's been special in the first half of the first game. 16 of 21, 221 yards. A touchdown earlier to Pittman. And now this one to Margin Hooks. See the ESPN first and 10 line. That's where BYU must go to keep the drive alive. Went to the corner. Beat the blitz with Margin Hooks to the 36. 14 yards with James Moore. Kirk, the secret to this play is the shotgun. Because they came from the outside, and being in the shotgun, watch the right side of your picture, he just doesn't get there, boom, he gets the ball off. That's the difference in the shotgun. Well, they're turning the blitz loose, but they can't play man-to-man. -man. That's the whole reason they scrapped this, the, the eight-man front and the man coverage, and there they had to play man because they blitzed. <laughs> Margin Hooks, seventh catch of the night, over 120 yards. These guys can go. Good throw from the gun. Tackle missed. Margin Hooks to the 46. That was 15 yards right there. Daryl Daniels had a chance to stop him earlier, did not. One of the reasons why this go play goes is Ferret. Watch him. He reads the coverage. Kirk, as that cornerback drops back, he hits the quick out. That's a very good play by a good quarterback. Quick thinking. See him? Montour drops yeah. back. There it is. That's it. That was an automatic right there. Yep. I tell you, he's doing a tremendous job. I think he loves the shotgun, would you think? Very where Cougar football has met 18 WAC titles in 27 years. Tonight, they try to take the first step to the first ever Mountain West title. On second and long, Federick looks long. Behind the secondary is Margin Hooks. 
The man Lee talked about in Sports Center to the 44. That's a pickup of 33. Uh, the reason why this works, Mike and Kirk, is the fact that they set up by scouting. Remember how many quick passes they hit to hooks the other week? Mm -hmm. Well, Colorado State obviously checked it. Boom. They immediately go to a good call, which is a hitch and go to hooks. He's the fastest man on the BYU team, and I still think he could be the difference in big plays here. On second and six. Federick on the move to margin hooks. First down at the 30. 15 minutes. First and 10 and shotgun with five receivers and no backs. Good pressure from the ends again. Margin hooks dropped it. Junior. We organized, they don't need him. <laughs> they need him to sh show up for the games. Second and ten for Federick. Oh, just missed time to break it up the pass, but Hicks, Hooks caught it. Hey. First for the Mountain West Conference. How about that guy? <laughs> that would be good, right, Don? Be good. Oh, it's a great story. Thanks, Jerry. Federick on first down. Caught by Margin Hooks, who stays in bounds across midfield. We'll mark him out at the 49. Give him 18 yards. BYU offense makes a key block on the wideout position to spring him and save Federick from the big hit. Three receivers out to the right and they come back against the formation to margin hooks and it's incomplete. Good coverage that time by Shenard Newby, the free safety. There he is number 20. Don't think six one freshman. Don't think we give receivers enough credit for blocking Hooks' effort to come back on the last play and lay the block to save a big hit off Federick. And he's taken nine or ten big hits tonight, just constantly getting hit. Hooks does a nice job of making an extra effort and, uh, and saving the big hit. Yep. You're back to cut off. Everybody there doing their job to make the play for BYU. As you pointed out earlier, good downfield blocking by the wideouts. Now they go up top, has a man. Touchdown, Hooks! Margin hooks, number 14, victimizing Jermaine Lazan. That's how you get rewarded. A couple plays earlier, Hooks comes back, makes a great block to take the hit off Federick. What's he do? You get a little man coverage outside. He went off the sideline on that last little stun. He's on the sidelines. He may be hurt. I have to look over at Staley and see what happened on the tackle last time. 7.50 to play in the third period. Virginia coming with a blitz. Federick unloads, has Hooks. Down to the seven yard line, another big one. Lazan and Williams finally corralling him at the seven. That's a way to keep a play alive. That's a receiver not quitting, that's a quarterback battling, getting the ball out there. Virginia's done a nice job all night except the last two possessions now. Hooks catches the, touch, the 30 yard touchdown last series. This series gets beyond the secondary. They've kept everything in front of them most of the time tonight. But breaking down and Federick being able to keep it alive, throwing off balance, taking another hit. But puts enough air on the ball to a wide open hook. Nine touchdowns for the fabulous freshman from Oregon. Outside, margin hooks is the go-to guy. Very, very fast. He is a playmaker. And the offensive line. Interesting story. The right guard, Matt Johnson, did not play high school football. Now he's 6'4", 310 pounds, 33 tackles this year. Quick pass on the out. And Air Force gets the ball near the 45-yard line. Margin Hawk hooks with his first catch of the day. BYU now with a third and 11. Well, Chris, that's a key to the zone blitz as well, is all the coverage downfield. I mean, they have to be playing a good zone coverage in the back, and, they, and Air Force is doing that. Federick throws far side, pass complete, first down. Pass complete to Margin Hooks, the junior from Waco, Texas, Tony Jones, wrestling him down, 20 yards on the completion. Well, we see uh, Federick get a ball out to the receiver right here. This is a big league throw. You know, we hear 
Well, what's the weakness that Federick has? Well, his arm strength. Right there, he didn't show it a bit. Todd Christensen, the former All-Pro for the Raiders, and now the ESPN announcer told me uh, he worked out with Margin Hooks, and he thinks that Margin Hooks has the potential to be a 70-catch, 1,000-yard guy in this BYU offense. Fahu Tahi checks in. Major's play right there. He's so exposed. You can see right as he lets go of the ball. You barely see it. You can tell where he's going. He's going right down on his shoulder. Third and ten for BYU. All time to throw. Hooks with the completion. Margin hooks. Hooks at the ten. Hooks. Touchdown, BYU. Well, Chris, right there, that could be the play that just breaks the Air Force's back. Kevin Federick drops back, has time. Margin Hooks runs an in route underneath the zone, and he catches the ball. The problem here with the Air Force defense is they just don't make tackles. They've got two guys right on there making the blow, but they don't wrap up and make a tackle. And then Hooks just uses his ability and speed and goes the rest of the way for a touchdown. They say Margin Hooks has sub 4.5 speed. And you can see why as we have a, a Falcon down. It looks like Tony Metters, number one, the junior from Texas. Well, you're going to see the injury right here, Chris, to Tony Metters. He just, wow, he takes it all. Margin, Margin's able to catch the ball. Instead of taking the blow, he delivers it. You know, that's a big... Uh,